today's video, I would like to introduce you to a very nice geometry problem of Mathematical Olympiad from Morocco. Here is the following figure. We have A, B, C, D as a square. Uh, within this square, we have two quarters of the circles. We have the quarter of the circle starting from the point A and at the point C. There is another quarter of the circle starting from the point B and at the point D. Okay. We have another small circle with the radius R touching three specific points. So touching the first circle at this point, touching the second circle at this point, and touching the side length of this square at this point. Okay. So since BC equals six, that means X is also the radius of both circles, big circles. Okay. Our goal we are going to calculate the radius of this small circle is noted as a R. Okay, go ahead, pause this video if you would like to give the try to this problem. When you are, you come back to see the full solution. By the way, don't forget to support us with your like and subscribe. Now, let's go ahead and jump into the solution. Since we have this small circle touching this side length of the square BC at this point, so that's mean we have a tangent line here. That's mean this line, uh, that's mean this line is perpendicular on, on this line because of the tangent. So, we'll have the right angle here. Now the next thing I'm going to drop off the line from the point perpendicularly on the segment CD. Okay. Now here is the right triangle. So now we have a new right triangle here. Let's call this one as a O prime. Okay. And let's call this distance X. Okay. Let's call this point as a B prime. Now in order to calculate R, we are going to create a right triangle. Okay. Since we have the right triangle here. I'm going to draw another line from the point O touching the point D. Okay. Now I have a new line passing from the O and passing from the, this tangent point specifically here. That means this distance, since this point going through this point here, that means th th this one is a radius of this circle, which is 6. We have this distance R because the radius of the small circle. Now we are going to apply the Pythagorean theorem on this triangle O D O prime. Okay, so the triangle O O prime D as a right triangle. We have this distance six as the radius as the radius of this big circle. Okay, equals six plus r quadratic square, which is this distance equals this distance. Let's call this distance O O prime equals O. O prime square plus this distance d o prime d o prime square okay now d o prime will be replaced with so d o prime equals c d okay as a radius of this circle minus this distance x so we'll have six plus r square o, o prime i'm going to leave o, o prime as is it i'm going to have o, o prime square plus d o prime d o prime as i said it will be replaced with six minus x six minus x square now we need to calculate o, o prime i'm going to draw another line from the point o to the point c since i have a new line here now i have a new triangle or as a right triangle i have o i have o c o prime so now i'm allowed to apply the Pythagorean theorem. So I will have on the right triangle I have O O prime C as a right triangle. I have this distance O C O C. As we know, I'm going to extend I'm going to extend this line like this. This is R, okay? Because we have the small circle with, with the radius R. I'm going to apply the Pythagorean theorem on this triangle. So I will have OC square equals this distance o, o prime square plus this distance the x. This distance x square. Okay. Now I'm going to calculate OC. As we know, OC is this distance equals this distance minus r. This distance is a, is a radius of this big circle. The, the radius of this big circle is 6. So that's mean I'm going to replace OC, OC with this distance, which is 6, 
minus this distance r, the, the, the radius of the small circle. But we need o, o prime. I'm going to leave o, o prime as is it. O prime. I'm going to replace x since we have a rectangle O B prime C O prime. That's mean R equals to X. Okay? It will be replaced X with R. We'll have R square. Now I'm going to combine the first equation and the second equation. We have O prime here, we have O prime here. By combining number one and number two, I will have O prime here, O prime square equals six minus R square minus r square i'm going to use the first equation i will have six plus r square equals o prime which is this one six minus r quinary square minus r square plus this distance plus six minus x x will be replaced as i said with small r because the radius of this small circle minus r quinary square now i'm worried to solve this equation 6 minus r square with 6 minus r will become 2 times I have 2 times 6 minus r quinary square minus r square okay now i'm going to simplify this equation i will have this one becomes 36 plus 2 times r6 is giving us 12 r plus r square this one is giving us 2 times is multiplied by 36 minus 12 r plus r square minus r square so i'm going to simplify this one more i will have 36 plus 12 r plus r square is given as 2 is multiplied by 36 which is 72 2 is multiplied by 12 is given as 24 r plus 2 r square minus r square so this one So this one become 72 minus 20 r, 24 r plus r square, 2 r square minus r square. So now, so r square will be cancelled r out from the left and the right side of his equation. I'm going to move over r terms to the left and the numbers to the right. We'll have uh, 24 plus 12, which is 36 r equals 72 minus this 36 is giving us 36 equivalent r equals 1 okay so i have done with this problem if you also if you are interested in watching the geometry problems i'm going to add some geometry problems to the comment section below from my old videos if you are interested in watching this one don't forget to support us with your like and subscribe thank you for watching i will see you in the next video bye